and the bloody the That's bloody the towel left. from some i mean there's there's conflicting reports of what the you know the state of this bloody towel because i think when you or me or any you know normal person thinks of a murder scene you think of a bloody towel like okay there's a murder this is a lot of blood but it truly looked as if someone had maybe a bloody hand and were to have like just wiped the face or yeah, it looked like there was like streaks from wiping yeah. the face. Yeah. Like, what I imagine read. you eat a big old sauce plate of ribs, right? And you're all sauced up, and you just got to clean that, right? Yeah. That's what it looked. They're like, Quick yeah, it's like there wasn't. It wasn't like someone's cleaning blood off the floor, blood off the bed, blood off the body. It looked I like mean, you were just cleaning up. There, there wasn't a lot of blood on it. So that's it's bizarre that there would just be like the thing before. What the fuck? Like you're not killing anybody with a soup plate. Why the fuck's your soup yeah. plate? I'm not a murder weapon. No. So, like, what did the what did the coroner report? So the coroner Say. reported that um, Lily must have had sex just before her death because a condom was found in her anus. In her oh, anus. the old rubber anus. tail. Okay, yeah, yeah. Uh, and saliva found on her neck, most likely the rapist's the murder. And to mention, like you say, the saliva. Apparently, there was like fucking copious amounts of saliva, like, like a yeah. bizarre, like a dog, like like, like a, a salivating dog waiting for yeah. dinner, like weird. Well, even weird, weirder, weird amount of when saliva. you think of like how clean the rest of the scene was, right? And so obviously, when you're looking in this apartment, like you know, with this kind of murder, like had to be a bloody mess, right? Well, we haven't even talked about how she was murdered. So, yeah, the coroner deduces that she was probably killed with multiple blows to the head, probably during intercourse. So hit in the head with, like, a blunt object several times. Uh, but, yeah, yeah, no object found. And she, she no was found on, found, her found back, right? on her back, So she was probably killed by surprise from behind. Yeah. Like Yeah, that's why they're, they're saying probably during the act clubbed with the blunt, blunt I don't want to like I'm not proud of this but I've seen it <laughs> speculated a lot and like I'm not punch. To be disrespectful but a lot of people mentioned yeah, I, saw punch. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that too <laughs> I'm like, no, that punch. is horrifying and I just yeah, didn't want to about say anything to it uh, but, but it, it's worse than that because you know this isn't this is like her skull was caved in her skull was completely caved in, and you know what the, the crazy? Okay, so we got this weirdly tidy Dan, room, Dan, right? Dan, it's, Dan, it's okay. I'm sorry, buddy. Right. Like, listen, I, I'm sorry. We good? Right, we're, we're trying to we're be okay? respectful, and we're trying to do justice right. to the case. That was my bad. I'm sorry. The donkey punch, punch too much. Punch. Okay, okay, all right. There's donkey right. punch is too much. All right. Why? Well, hey. No need to yell, buddy. It's all good. You liked the donkey punch, didn't you? Um, yeah, he liked it. He liked it. Um, so that's not even the weirdest part about this, right? Like we're about to get to the weirdest fucking. Like this is the most bizarre fact. It of actually doesn't make case. any sense at all. No, there was blood found on this said ladle. So well, that's not the weird part. Like, <laughs> yep, yeah, that's, that's not, not the, the weird, weird part. <laughs> the fact that okay, so there was blood found on this ladle, but that was it. Lily had completely exsanguinated. There was zero. She had no blood left in her the body. Blood was there was gone. some gone blood residue underneath her, but not enough for someone to have not to make up for no blood. Bludgeoned her. She was there was no to death. And blood splatter. In a in a head trauma like that, like you have a lot of blood in your head so you would there be huge, should be a huge pool around there, her no okay so like your head like you you we've all done it right like there, we have no vasospasm mechanism in our scalp in what our head mean? what does that mean we, so when you get a wound when you get a cut there's like on your arms anywhere in your periphery anything like that you have a vasospasm mechanism where the well, the skin and the, the musculature wants to close to help clot like stop and clot the bleed. You don't have that in your head, so that's why when you have these little tiny fucking nicks on your head, they bleed they for hours. Bleed and bleed like a little right? eyebrow cut when you get punched or something. A, a lot of elderly people when they fall and they hit their head, they can bleed out because if they can't get up and stop the bleed, and it could be this like it could be a tiny wound, right? And so the fact that she's been bludgeoned, well, you got to think that sw this swing motion that like as you would be hitting, 
you would be getting blood on whatever object you hit Splatter. yeah and you would be spraying it up and down and in and the impact as the wound you were hitting like her head was her skull was caved in in i mean i i, I was gonna i'm gonna assume their capabilities of like looking for blood splatter and stuff like that was probably pretty yeah they bit. didn't have csi other than it being yeah, obvious but the, Right. I mean, that's what I mean. It should, well, it should be obvious. In at least some of it should be obvious in that yeah. type of injury. You would think. I yeah, agree. it's like they yeah. didn't have black lights to like. This has been cleaned. And so why why is there blood on a soup ladle? It was deduced that perhaps it was dipped and perhaps was sipped from said ladle. Like it tastes well, and some of the reports were that this ladle sitting wherever it was found had they had to make that deduction because it wasn't just like stained with blood, but there was that was like the most blood pooling they found was in this ladle sitting in the ladle. And based it's not from a splatter, it's it had to have been and put then in based there. on the based on the you know, the, where it had dried and stuff, they had been like, it, it kind of looks like someone maybe were, was drinking from it. Right? Oh, it's oh. fucking creepy. It's, it's, it's fucking, like, super bizarre to me, though, because the fact, like, the, the killer went out of his way to leave so, like, we gotta, I think one of the most important things is, is this is the 30s, all right? Like, fucking... Horatio and all the other fucking CSI guys yeah. don't exist, right? They're not calling in the big dogs. They don't have special equipment. They have no idea what DNA evidence is. They don't. I don't even think they know what DNA is at this point in time, right? If they do, it'd be a, just a theory and not any type of no like, research. In, in today, in today's world, you've got semen, right? You've got saliva. You've got well, fucking semen you've like back bingo, then bingo, too. Bongo. Well, no, you know, like, but DNA I mean, database. Yeah, obviously. <laughs> We would need condoms if that were the case. But it, it's just bizarre to me that <laughs> the killer obviously went out of his way to leave behind so many few, like, so few clues, right? But and it, like, reminds so me of, like, uh, there was an old fucking Sherlock story that I used to love. And, like, the, I remember the bad guy, the, like, when he was deducing, when the game yeah. was afoot, he, like, Sherlock said, he's like, the lack of evidence in itself is evidence. Well, and the... the they, right? they did like have no CSI back then. You're 100% correct. But they did have the ability to pull fingerprints and, like, fingerprinting. It, ba it basically, like, they didn't have computer analysis, but, like, they could do fingerprint matching by, you know, overlays and stuff like that. And there was no fucking fingerprints found at the scene. Well, I read there actually was. I heard there was a ton. There was, there was so ton. many that they couldn't yeah. so differentiate. I heard, I heard they pulled so many, they pulled a lot of fingerprints, but because she had so many clients, they actually interviewed a bunch of her clients and nothing came out of it. But one thing I want, I want to touch on to come back to that bloody rag. It was also mentioned that perhaps it looked like someone wiped a bloody mouth. Yeah. Yeah. That's what we were the, talking about that. Yeah. That's yeah. weird. Right. Yeah. So is that just a soup ladle? Is that just sipping from a soup ladle or from the wound is, is a, would it be perhaps from a bite. I mean, there There's, is no puncture wounds no, from like teeth. You don't, you don't need a, no, you don't need a, you don't need puncture wounds because the head and blood is You're already available. Because where the did head. the blood go if it's not on the floor? That's what I'm saying. Yeah. I mean, now, it's, it, here's the thing too, is like, I, I thought about that because like, if, if you drank a full human's worth of, of blood, yeah. You would fucking go into liver failure. Like That's you would incorrect, hundred percent all the way. That's not <laughs> it's possible, but that's in one sitting. If you now, have no if blood, like, if you have no blood in your body already, and you're trying to replenish, you need a full human's worth of blood. Do you, do you think this guy took some? Where like, to go? Do you think this guy took to go take containers or? Well, that's or he's that. some that. Well, that's that came across as well because if it didn't. If it's his own pooling on the ground, he must have had a way to stop it from spreading while she's bleeding, right? So but the bleeding would be I so – because so I – like one of the things I immediately thought about was based on the – what they look at is the obvious cause of death is the blunt force trauma. I instantly go like, 
Well, I don't think that can be the case with the lack of blood. Like, you, to be able to, ex- like, what, extanguate? Oh, so you think it's post That's what I was kind of thinking. Think I was thinking that she would have oh, to have been oh. drained of blood. And then- Hey, guys, thanks for watching. I know it's annoying to watch these broken up in 10-minute segments, but here's the next one over here. Or if you want to watch the whole thing uncut and after hours, just click this link to our website and uh, give us a donation. You get full access to it on Patreon. Anyways, thanks, guys. Enjoy the next video.